What's up today my fellow mass soldiers? So what I'm going to be doing right now is showing you guys what you should be doing right now to make sure you don't miss out on all your coins, packs, and players that you're going to be getting for free. Right now it's, it's still a little bit time in order to get this done. I usually don't get it. I usually don't start this early um, to do a video like this. But the reason why I'm doing a video like this right now is because um there is a few weeks away and i want to make sure you because daily objectives are everything and that's going to help you be able to accomplish a lot of the stuff that you need to get done so i want to make sure that i put this out to you before time goes by fast and you miss out on, on all the things you, um, you're going to be able to get so anyways let's go ahead and get into it so come over here and check out season four right i'm gonna go ahead and click on it and right up there at the top as you guys could tell depending on when you see it it might say 21 days, like mine says right here, 21 days, 19 hours and 40 minutes when this season pass ends, or you might see it later and the time might even be more shortened, or you might see it way late, a long time and it might not even be there no more. But anyways, the whole thing is, it's 21 days, so it's basically three weeks away. And I'm telling you guys this right now is because daily objectives are pivotal when it comes to this and the days are going to go by so fast that you, I don't want to make, I want to make sure you guys don't miss out on this stuff. So... Let's go ahead and check out the daily track tracker and show you guys what I'm talking about. So as you complete daily objectives, after every five days, you're going to be um, getting XP. It goes all the way up to 40 days. As you can tell, I got 20, 20, and 25 left. So that's 20, 40, 60, 65,000 season XP that, I, that I'm still able to get in order to level up my season pass before it ends so I don't miss out on all the rewards that I do want to get. Um, and on top of that, you do your daily objectives right now, which I show you guys, you're getting 3,000 right here, 2,000 right here, and 1,000 right here. So all together, we'll, I'll simplify it. You're going to get 6,000 just from doing your daily objectives every single day. Six times seven is 42. So that's 42,000 XP that you're getting every single week just by doing your daily objectives. That's not including your milestones that you're going to get. So that's what you want to be working on right now in order to get that done. Now that we're doing this, we'll go get a pack in the store. Oh, it's not out yet. Did they stop it or nah? They must have stopped it because I didn't open mine yesterday and uh, it's not here no more. The the one coin pack. Let me know if they if they stopped it because I don't see it here no more. So I don't know if they stopped it or not. But anyways, yeah, do your daily objectives. And this is what we're what we're working on. So what I got next? Oh, I got oh I got with Jerry Rice next. So he will be a receiver on my team because uh, he's gonna be one of the top ones once I do get him. But anyways. Let's go check this out. I actually got, oh, it actually shows that I got them in the lineup. That's crazy. I've never seen that before. But anyways, yeah, here we go right here. We're gonna get uh, free Chris Jones. We got these coins. We got this season four set token. What I like about this is with the, I guess at any time, if you wanna redeem one token, I think you get like a 90 overall, two tokens, a 92, a 92 plus or a 92 overall. I'm gonna wait till I get four tokens, and I was told with the four tokens, which it shows you what you'll check out right now, you're gonna get a 94 overall player. So I'm close to getting that other token. So I'm three levels away to getting that four token, and I'm gonna redeem it to see what I'm actually able to get, right? But you don't wanna miss out. These rewards this season, I actually like all of them. I like the Jerry Rice, I like that defensive tackle, Chris Jones, I like the uh, Ray Lewis, I want to get that. I'm going to get to level 50 and make sure that I get that last token to get him up to a nice six. So all these rewards are pretty legit to me. And so I want to at least, at least get up to the season five collectible. Um, Because the season five collectible. Wow. Oh, here he goes on top. All right. Anyways. Yeah, the season five collectible, as you guys see right here, it's going to give you 20,000 season XP towards your season five uh, fill pass. So that's what I at least try to get up to. If I don't, whatever, most likely I'm going to. Um, I keep on doing my daily objectives and my other stuff. But you don't want to miss out on that because that's gonna that's where you, that's gonna help you level up a lot faster when it comes to your your uh, season five fill pass. All right. So this is all the stuff that you're getting. Let's go over here to your uh, milestones. And even if you're just starting out today, or you just started out this past week, or if you've been doing it for a while, make sure you go over here and check out all your objectives. Right. Um, I got a couple more games and I'll be able to get this 12,000 XP. But with this being said right here, you're going to get tons of XP just from doing these weekly objectives that they actually add every single week. So don't miss out on this. 
Um, hopefully there should be another one coming week five. Um, and it's going to give you guys tons of XP that you're going to help level up your season pass. And the good thing about these is that even if you just start out today, these will be all fresh for you to, to complete. It means that after week one, they don't disappear, so you can't do it. So you still have time to get these out the way and level up your season pass as fast as you can. Now let's go ahead and back out. The next thing, there's a few things to go over. So... There's a few things to go over, so I want to make sure that I go over all this stuff because there's some people that tell me that you just started playing the game, so I want to make sure you guys are hip to what's going on because you're going to end up missing out if you guys don't know what's going on. So, same thing with the competitive pass. Look on top. It ends in 23 days in 19 hours and 10 minutes. The other one's 21 days. That's the, the that's a good thing about the competitive pass because it always resets on a Friday. The season pass resets sooner, so the season pass will end sooner than the, than the competitive pass, but check it out though. You want, if depending on what you get, give yourself a target saying that, okay, I at least want to get up to here. Whatever your target is, like, I'm not trying to fully max it out because to me, there's no benefit no more besides the season XP, which I wouldn't mind. But as you guys can tell, like, I don't see myself maxing this out. I just do my daily objectives. And if I have to get, if I happen to get as far as I can, I'm cool. But give yourself an objective to get as far as you want to go. So, say for instance, you want to get to level 40. Calculate what it's going to take to get to level 40. Make sure you do your daily objectives because these daily objectives, as, as the title says, daily objectives, they reset every single day. So you're missing out on six. That's 10, 12, 12 competitive points every single day. Um, and that's a tons of tons of that's tons of competitive points every single week if you're not doing your daily objectives. So you want to make sure you get that done to help you up level up your competitive pass in order to level it up and also get your season XP as you're leveling it up. I just go for solo battles and I go for milestones. So that's what I've been working on. But for those who want to go faster, you guys go ahead and do head to head season and mud champs. You'll be able to max out the competitive pass a lot faster and get a lot of your guys' rewards. Now let's go ahead and back out. This is something that some people, a lot of people do know, but there, there may be some people, especially new ones that don't know. So I want to show you guys. Look at the playoff program and look at the Super Bowl program. They're both going to end the same day as season four. So the solos, I don't know if they're going to stay because usually they'll take out the solos. So you want to make sure you get all your solos done because if not, um, it's possible that they will reset because that's what they've been doing. Um, but even if they don't reset, um, you're going to miss out on all these rewards from the season pass. I'm sorry, from the Super Bowl pass and the playoff pass if you guys don't get these done now and start working on them because, as you guys tell, they end the season pass, the playoff pass, and the Super Bowl pass are going to end in 21 days. Same thing as the season pass, all right? So now, real quick, let's go to the challenges and see. I don't know if they're going to say they're going to end, but they usually say they usually end, though, which is going to be the Super Bowl and playoff. Does it actually have a date? It don't say a date, but even if it don't say a date on here, because I don't see no date saying it's going to end, um, don't put it past them. Make sure you knock them out because I've seen them before in the past where you don't see the other programs we had. We had a lot of other programs that they're no longer here because EA took them out after the 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 um, the season the season was over with or the season was like we're on season four. So the other season, season three, two, and one, the the programs that were there part, part of those seasons are no longer the solos are no longer here only certain ones that they still keep so i wouldn't put it past them so make sure you guys get that knocked out but that's why i want to do a video on this just to remind you guys we still got three weeks away yeah it's a little bit of time but the daily objectives are pivotal start working on it because you don't want the days to fly by and you miss out on opportunity to get the most out of this game so anyways without further ado i'm out